When you think of the F-22 Raptor you picture a sleek powerful fighter jet, built for total dominance of the sky. Its stealth lets it slip past enemy radar and its engines give it unmatched speed and agility. For years the Raptor has ruled air-to-air -air combat, a symbol of terrestrial power and the pinnacle of atmospheric flight. But what if the Raptor's greatest contribution isn't in the sky but in space? Space is a different realm, hostile, silent and governed by new rules. The real upgrade isn't to the jet, but to the human inside it. We're not talking about modifying the F-22 to fly in a vacuum. That's science fiction. Instead, it's about the pilots, individuals who master this complex machine and are pushed to the limits of human performance. Their split-second decisions at supersonic speeds forge skills that are invaluable for space missions. These pilots are becoming NASA's secret weapon, a human upgrade for space exploration. The F-22, once an earthbound predator, now indirectly shapes our journey to the stars. It's the ultimate training ground, forging pilots with the mental and physical fortitude to command spacecraft. The Raptor's secret role in space isn't about new engines or heat shields. It's about the pilot, whose journey from cockpit to command module marks a new chapter in our quest to explore the final frontier. The story of the F-22 is no longer just about air dominance, it's about launching humanity further than ever before. What makes an F-22 pilot so special? It's not just flying a plane, it's mastering one of the world's most complex systems. In the cockpit, information floods in from every direction. Pilots process threats and make life-or-death decisions in seconds. This intense environment forges resilience and cognitive skills, nearly identical to those needed in space. Both fighter jets and spacecraft demand flawless systems management and calm under pressure. F-22 pilots juggle flight controls, weapons, and communications, just as astronauts monitor trajectory, life support, and docking. The core skills are the same, discipline, situational awareness, and the ability to act decisively when everything is on the line. The F-22 is a high-gravity, high-velocity simulator for the challenges of space. The real crossover isn't hardware, it's the human-machine interface. F-22 pilots are experts at working with automation, trusting their instruments, and intervening when needed. Modern spacecraft are heavily automated, and astronauts must be ready to take control if something goes wrong. NASA seeks out these pilots for their ability to manage automation and handle the unexpected. Instead of reinventing astronaut training, NASA taps into the Air Force's pipeline of elite aviators. The investment in a single Raptor pilot pays off twice as a top-tier defender and a potential astronaut. The F-22 program has become an unintentional but premier source of future space explorers. The skills honed in the Raptor's cockpit are now propelling humanity into the cosmos. Major Nicole Vapor Ayers is the living proof of this crossover. Before NASA, she was an accomplished F-22 pilot, logging over 1,400 flight hours, including 200 in combat. Her skills were forged in real-world conflict, not just simulations. From Alaska's 90th Fighter Squadron to NASA's Astronaut Corps, her journey is a testament to dedication and talent. In 2021, NASA selected her for astronaut training, recognizing the value of her operational background. On March 14, 2025, she piloted the SpaceX Crew-10 mission to the International Space Station. Her role was far from ceremonial. She monitored the Dragon spacecraft systems and was ready to take manual control if needed. Her F-22 experience made her the ultimate backstop for mission success. Arriving at the ISS, she joined Expedition 73 for a six-month research mission, vital for future exploration, including Artemis missions to the moon. Major Air's story is more than personal achievement, it's proof that defending our planet can prepare us to leave it. She's a pioneer, showing that the path to the stars can begin in a fighter jet. The skills honed in combat now drive scientific discovery in orbit. Her journey redefines what it means to be an astronaut. What truly sets an F-22 pilot apart isn't just technical skill, it's mindset. Extreme discipline, adaptability and teamwork are at the core. In the air, Raptor pilots rely on their wingmen, communicating through secure data links to build a complete picture of the battle space. This collaborative spirit is essential on the International Space Station, where astronauts from different nations must live and work together for months. F-22 pilots like Major Ayers arrive with this mindset ingrained, clear communication, mutual trust, and putting the team above ego. 
Contingency planning is second nature. Every flight is preceded by briefings for every conceivable emergency. This what-if mentality is critical in space where small problems can escalate fast. The ability to anticipate, react calmly and solve problems under stress is the most important skill an astronaut can have. The ISS is a complex aging machine. Things break, experiments go wrong and challenges arise. Astronauts must troubleshoot with limited resources just as fighter pilots do in the air. The mental discipline to analyze, identify, and execute solutions under pressure is a perfect match for life in orbit. It's a mindset of resilience and resourcefulness. The F-22 cockpit doesn't just train pilots, it forges leaders for the most demanding environments. This mindset is now as valuable in space as it is in the sky. The Raptor's greatest export may be the way its pilots think. The Crew-10 mission in 2025 was more than a trip to the ISS, it was a symbol of global collaboration. The crew included Major Ayers, a NASA astronaut, a Japanese JAXA astronaut, and a Russian cosmonaut. Despite tensions on Earth, the ISS remains a beacon of peaceful partnership. Their six-month mission focused on over 200 experiments in biology, physiology, and materials science. Research vital for future Moon and Mars missions. The mission also showcased NASA's new model public-private partnerships. SpaceX's Falcon 9 and Dragon capsule restored U.S. launch capability, making space access more reliable and cost-effective. Major Ayers, an active-duty officer flying a commercial spacecraft as part of an international crew, embodies this new era. Her presence signals a future where military, civilian, and commercial sectors unite to push boundaries. Collaboration is now the engine of progress in space. The best talent and technology from every sector are coming together. The result? Faster innovation, deeper exploration, and a more connected world. The future of space is teamwork, on a planetary scale. The military NASA connection is nothing new, Mercury's first astronauts were all test pilots, but today the alliance is deeper and more strategic. The Crew-10 mission saw Major Ayers, an Air Force pilot, replace Space Force Colonel Nick Haig on the ISS, a symbolic passing of the torch. The Space Force protects U.S. interests in orbit while NASA explores and innovates. Their missions overlap, NASA pioneers technology, Space Force ensures security. This partnership extends to personnel, military officers gain first-hand space experience, then bring that knowledge back to their services. It creates a feedback loop, strengthening both civilian and military space capabilities. The F-22 program's pilots are now ideal candidates for NASA and Space Force alike. A Raptor pilot's career could lead to commanding a squadron, piloting a moon mission, or overseeing orbital operations. This versatility ensures U.S. leadership in both air and space. While its pilots reach for the stars, the F-22 Raptor is evolving on Earth. Once slated for retirement, the Raptor is now being reimagined as a commander of robotic wingmen. The F-22 will direct autonomous drones, collaborative combat aircraft, multiplying its effectiveness and keeping pilots out of danger. This shift requires major upgrades, new control tablets, enhanced sensors, and secure data links. The Air Force is investing heavily, ensuring the Raptor remains a dominant force. Globally, other nations are racing to develop their own loyal wingman drones, by leading this revolution the F-22 stays relevant for decades to come. The lone wolf of the skies is becoming the ultimate pack leader. Its adaptability is its greatest strength. The Raptor's evolution mirrors the changing face of warfare and the future of flight. The F-22's evolution, both pilot and machine, signals a future where air and space are no longer separate domains. The skills to master a jet are now the skills to command a spacecraft. Technologies like autonomous drones and human-machine teaming are central to both air combat and space exploration. Imagine vehicles that take off like planes, reach orbit and return to a runway, piloted by aviators with hybrid skills. The F-22's training and command systems could become blueprints for managing robotic teams on the Moon or Mars. Advances in military aviation feed civilian space innovation, and vice versa. The feedback loop of progress is accelerating. The Raptor's dual legacy, as fighter and stepping stone to space, shows the power of integration. The future of aerospace is synergy, not separation. The sky is no longer the limit, it's just the beginning. The F-22 Raptor began as the ultimate air superiority fighter. 
but its true legacy is now written in the stars. The real upgrade isn't hardware, it's human potential. Pilots like Major Ayers prove that the path to space can start in a fighter cockpit. The Raptors' training, discipline and mindset are now launching humanity further than ever. It's a bridge between worlds, air and space, warfighter and explorer. The F-22 spirit embodied in its pilots is now orbiting Earth and charting a course for the moon and beyond. The Raptor remains a symbol of dominance, but now it's also a symbol of human aspiration driving us from the sky to the stars.